Hello, welcome to today's video. My name is Kaylee. I'm a junior content copywriter at an advertising agency here in Houston, Texas. Recently graduated from Texas A&M University and clearly I am a dog mom. This is Stanley. Um, today's video is a monthly reset video, just going through the normal stuff. Uh, this installment is happening on Sunday. I am going grocery shopping, cleaning up the apartment a little bit, getting meal planning and produce ready for this next week. Um, and then later on in the week, I will sit down with my budget and my 2022 goals and how I can break them down into monthly ones. And yeah, we'll just kind of go through all of that. Um, and anything else that I decide to throw in here along the way. Um, but yeah, glad you guys are joining me. Stanley and I already picked up our groceries from HEB. Today was a light haul because I kind of stocked up last week and just needed some basic things like bread, bananas, and eggs um, this time around. So Stanley and I are going to head back inside and put up our groceries and get meal planning ready for this week. Hello, howdy, it is time. Hold on, I'm gonna turn this light off. Hello, howdy, it is time for the Monday installment of this monthly reset video. I have recently finished updating my notion for the month um, of like getting it ready for February and you know, just kind of the way that I want it in general. I don't know how much more customization um, I will be doing. I mean, this is just, these things on my Notion are just like what's on my mind right now. Um, so that's why I chose them as my customizations. Um, so yeah, we shall see how much updating I make to my Notion, but I'm gonna give you guys a quick tour because I'm very happy with it. So I updated my homepage, turned it back into a picture of me. I used to just make it themed and then traveling is very much on my mind right now so that's why we got the airplanes um and then here we have grouped together some like general overarching um work pages that i have um and then of course picture of stanley um this is a picture from new york um and then these are things that i use on the daily my morning routine my night routine and my habit tracker and then here is where all of my planning happens. Um, we've got my calendar where I keep my um, schedule for videos and like uploading, planning, editing, filming them. Um, I keep it all organized there. And then we've got a new template with this to-do list. Um, it's like a task template. Um, I will show it to you guys in just one second. And then I've got just a general page for planning videos where I'm getting ideas jotted down for March and then my travel planning tab. This is kind of a modified template. Um, I've changed it up just to work a little bit better for me. And then I changed out my Spotify um, link here to be the Houston Rodeo because I desperately want to go to the rodeo this year. Don't know why, it's just on my mind. Um, so I'm gonna show you guys my to-do list tab. I also updated like all of the covers on all of my um, tabs. So they're like actual pictures. Um, and I really like it. So I just will be doing this by month um, and then updating and deleting the tasks then. So here is January. I only recently um, started using this page, so there's not a whole lot going on. 
Um, so this month I still need to give Stanley a bath. I need to start planning um, some trips in the process of planning this one. Um, I'll talk about my trips later. Um, and some finance things that need to be done. I need to clean my apartment, um, vacuum, do basic cleaning things. Um, and then also start working on finding a new place to live because I want to, we're gonna try and flip this around, because I want to live in a place where Stanley can have an enclosed area to go run around and like I don't have to go to the park and it's just right there outside the door because whether that's in a house with a yard or like in an apartment where um, there's like a dog park within the complex because I thought that was gonna be the case here, but then it wasn't. So we just have this grassy area outside the door um, for him to go to the bathroom in, um, but there's no like dog park area. Um, so yeah, that's why I wanna find a new place to live. And then I'm in the process of planning out my camping trip for this weekend and an organ trip and updating my budget should be updated i'll finish that with you guys um, and then i went grocery shopping with you guys and my notion is all updated makes me very happy um, and then the other page i'm showing you guys is my travel planning page this is a template from the notion template gallery i linked that in my previous notion video um but they have like a very in their template they have a very extensive list of like this tab was for where you're staying this is for like activities this is for where you're eating um but i would just need general plans for like all of the things i want to do this year so i have the year at the top um and then these are all the places that i want to try and go this year sister trip um, me and courtney want to go up to oregon visit some family so it'd be a free place to stay um, visit my friend April in Florida, once again a free place to stay, same with Izzy in Boston, um, and then a family vacation. We still need to do planning, but it will be happening sometime in the summer when my parents are out of school. Um, and then Emily and I want to go back to advertising week this year because it was just so much fun, go explore New York some more, um, hopefully bring Kelly back even though she no longer works with Decode, and possibly bring our friend Beck along. I think we would all just have so much fun. Um, and then last one is I want to find someone to go to Chicago, Illinois with me. And I think my friend Maggie might go because she said she has a friend there. But we'll see. I also just really want to go to Chicago. Chicago can change. Um, but yeah, that is my updated notion. So, what, yep, like I said, this is my updated notion. Um, and then the last thing I need to do to get ready for this month um, is to make sure my January budget is all up to date. And yeah, I don't know if I ever showed you guys this, um, but here is my new um, budget spreadsheet that I'm using, um, Carter Sullivan, um, an awesome YouTuber. I love watching her stuff, like no matter what it is, I just love watching Carter's videos. Um, but she made this template um, budget spreadsheet for anybody to use. Um, and so I wanted to try something new with my budgeting. And so I took it and made it a little bit more to what I want, to what I need out of a budget. Um, so I kept this money hub on the front page um, where it has your monthly income, roughly monthly budget, um, and then current savings goals. I will later do a whole at sometime in February I'll do a whole look at my finances and film that with you guys where I'll talk look more into my savings and how that's going um so we're not going to get into that yet but um this next tab is my spending plan I have all my expenses laid out with monthly estimates and clearly I went over January's budget um, this past month, I did not do a good job of keeping up with my spending when I actually spent money. Um, and so that is something I want to improve on for February. Um, and really try and keep that number under 900 instead of almost $1,400 because that's a lot. Although I will have to say, um, Stanley's puppy budget was a little mm, because I'm paying for half of new classes and then also we had some vet bills 
um, because he has an ear infection right now. So we're treating that. Um, so that's why the pet bill um, puppy budget part is a little bit higher. Um, but I did do good of keeping track of all the payments made. I made sure I paid everybody for all my stuff, rent, um, and then phone, car insurance, um, and Spotify and Apple TV all go to my mom. Um, and so I just really wanted to keep track of that and make sure that I actually get those payments to her. Um, and then the investing tab will also be something to go over with you guys later in this next finances video. Um, but yes, my budget is all up to date um, as of January 24th. Um, so yeah, there will definitely be some more spending this month, so this number will continue to go up. But it should just be gas and stuff for camping. So not too much more spending to go on this month. Um, I will, I am, because I need to go ahead and add Stanley's other half of the classes because we'll finish class next month. So I just added that. So I don't forget to add it. Um, but yeah, this is my new budget. Um, I'm Now that I'm like, okay, so the beginning of January was like a little weird. I wasn't like super motivated to do anything clearly because I didn't post on YouTube hardly at all until like halfway through the month and I obviously didn't keep track of my spending or like update Notion or anything until now. Um, and so, yeah, I am just really ready for February and to step things up and get back into everything again. Um, so yeah, I am feeling rejuvenated. I'm ready to do all of the planning. And yes, I am just very excited for what this year already holds. Um, but like another YouTuber that I watched, Tess Barclay, um, said on one of her recent podcast episodes, January doesn't count. January is still for figuring your life out. Um, and that is, I didn't think that was going to be me the first time I heard her say that, but clearly that is me. So thank you, Tess. Um, yes. I think that is all I wanted to discuss with you guys. Um, so this is the end of my February reset video. Also, I'm just obsessed with this hair scarf. I got it from Target. I'm obsessed. Um, this is the second day in a row that I've worn it and I may try and find an outfit to wear it with tomorrow. We'll see. But anyways, thank you guys for joining me on this monthly reset video. Um, if you have any questions about copywriting, how I stay organized, anything like that, um, leave a comment down below. I appreciate you guys watching this video and I will see you guys next time. And remember, do what makes you happy. Bye.